Here we go. Welcome back. Our next segment on bullying is um, we have the president, Naomi, and we have um, Chloe, who is the vice president, and uh, Nina. Oh, no. We have Cheyenne. Cheyenne, Stephanie. Okay. All right. Um, Naomi, as president, talk about what your responsibilities are and what you're trying to accomplish with the anti bullying club. Um, well, um, our goal is really just to pay it forward, to do the right thing, um, to really reach out to those in need. Um, we, don't, we don't want to be silenced anymore. You know, there's a lot of schools that don't have a program for anti bullying or don't have a club. Um, and we have the opportunity to have a club and to stand up and to do these things um, for our school. And we just really want to make a change. That's really what it's really about. Um, my job is you know, to be there to support, give ideas, um, and kind of just try to steer the group in the right direction. Okay. Chloe, your thoughts? Um, so we organize different events to bring together people within our school and our community. We do, we go to different events, so as a club we go to Real Life for Life and walk the laps around. Um, we organize a three-on-three -three basketball to bring more kids together and we try to do a lot to get our club known in the school and the community. Cheyenne? Oh. Well, I mean, I'm like a freshman so I'm new to the school so I feel like I have to like live up to standards or like I have to do like stuff that like won't like bother like the upperclassmen and stuff like that. And everyone like gets bullied, but like this club kind of stands up for that. Like we give like the students who they like, can't say anything like a voice and like if they want to like come to us, they always can and they know that they can. Okay. That's great. Now, when you guys become aware of a student that's, going, that's getting bullied, do you reach out to that student? To talk about that whole process. Um, well, it depends the situation. Um, sometimes it can, if it's like a really bad situation, um, you know, having to do with suicide and um, stuff like that, um, we can help out a little bit, but it's really up to the professionals, like social workers, psychologists, and stuff like that. We kind of stand in the background, let them know that we're there if they need us. Um, but um, we're, the process is basically they go to the deans, they report an issue, um, we either have a mediation, um, it just depends on the situation. Um, sometimes cops have to get involved, um, or the principal, um, but we're really just there in anything. Chloe, well, we talk about what has meant to you being a part of this club. What kind of difference has it made being a part of this anti-bullying club? Um, so, it's made a big difference. I've been in it since my freshman year, and now I'm a junior at Long Beach High School, and it's like every year we get more people to join and we're just a family and we just we try to bring more people into our families open arms for everyone and uh, I think the fact that um, you guys are, you know one thing we want to talk about um, talk with Phil before the show is um, the cyberbullying do you talk about that a lot and, and how big of a problem do you feel some of your students deal with this the cyberbullying um, I feel like it, it's a problem because everyone's on social media and you can't erase anything that we put up. But it's, I would say it's not like, it's there, it's a very present problem, but like bullying in school and like in person goes on more, but it, it follows you, like it's, it's everywhere. So cyberbullying just, just lingers. Cheyenne? Talk about uh, your experiences with, with cyberbullying. Oh, well, I mean, there's definitely like an equal amount of like bullying like that happens in school and like out of school like cyberbullying. But like I feel like cyberbullying hurts like more because like you can like you think about it more like it's always there like Chloe was saying. How about you? Um, how about Naomi? Talk about your thoughts on, on cyberbullying because. It's something, like I said, everybody has a computer, everyone's on Facebook, so talk about the cyberbullying aspect. Um, well, in my personal um, life, I have dealt with cyberbullying before, and um, 
I, in my opinion, I think cyberbullying is definitely worse than personal, like face-to-face -face bullying. And I think cyberbullying is done more um, because on the internet you can be anonymous. There's a whole bunch of different things that you can do, um, and it's there for the whole world to see. You know, once it goes up, it can't be taken down, and um, you know that it affects the person. Right. Anybody in the audience want to come up and uh, have their thoughts? Anybody want to contribute? It's an open forum, so anybody that wants to talk about any of these issues, um, feel free to come on up. Come on up, come on up.